One further highlight is this gigantic elephant found here in Braun's Betra in 1986. And this gigantic uh, skeleton was found here in the virginity of Braun's Betra. Today, I would like to introduce my exhibition, Vars Columbus, 15,000 years too late. And I'm glad to show you the new display, the Argonauts of the Stone Age. So now we are starting the introduction in the exhibition. In the first part, is a display about the scientific backgrounds, about the similarities between the old and the new world, especially this enigmatic tobacco findings in Egyptian mummies. The question, did Pharaoh already smoke it, uh, a cigarette? And also enigmatic uh, map presentations between the old and the new world, star astronomy. Here's a wonderful, nice cinema where you can see our movies from Abora 1, 2, 3, and also 20,000 years old tools, and also about blonde-haired Maya Indians in Central America, everything about boats, about reed boats. It's a display about lead boat navigation to sail such a keyless reed raft across and even against the wind. And in the center of this display is our wonderful raft model Dilmun 4, which we use for training purposes in order to prepare the Abora 4 expedition. And now we are walking around the Dilmun 4 raft on which we have experienced the heaviest storm ever. On Abora, 156 kilometers per hour storm, we survived on this piece of reed. Well, and now we are in the new section the Argonauts of the Stone Age, everything about the adventures from Abora 4. The Search of the Iron of the Pharaohs is a subtitle of this new exhibition where I'm reporting everything about pyramid making the Iron of the Pharaohs, the enigmatic iron findings made in 2013 in the pyramid at Giza, and later we have discovered that Herodotus is reporting about iron and where the precious materials came from. And here we have the whole part of the making of the boat, the launching of the boat, and then the navigation from Varna through the Bosporus, the Mamara Sea, the Dardanelles. And in the other part here, we have the na navigation through the stormy Aegean Sea with almost eight Puford we navigated from Troy to Limnos, from Limnos to Santorini. And a la Hollywood, we navigated even through the caldera of Santorini. And after Santorini, we sailed to the Lykian coast in Turkey, where we ended the exhibition in Patara. Yeah, at the end of our display, I can invite you. Please come to Sachsen-Anhalt and visit our new exhibition, The Argonauts in the Stone Age. <laughs>